Okay, Des, uh, how excited were you to see the Titans trade up to get you? And how do you think you fit in in uh, Tennessee? You know, I was super excited, you know, just to get, you know, to hear the call and see Nashville area code pop up. And, you know, the conversation I had with the coaches, you know, I definitely felt wanted. And, you know, I can't wait to be a Titan. What did they tell you? Uh, you know, they just told me that, you know, they had to trade up for me when, you know, they saw that I was still on the board and, you know, they feel like I fit into, you know, what they're trying to do in Nashville. And, you know, I'm just I'm in such a great organization, such a great, you know, team. And I'm just I can't I, I'm lost at words right now. I'm so sorry. But, I, you know, I'm just so happy to be a Titan. You're on. Yeah, Des, we saw you do a lot of work on the outside, but you have the ability to play slot as well. What are some of the things that they talked about as far as your fit within this offense? Yes, sir. Uh, you know, they definitely uh, said that, you know, they saw the reps that I had in the senior bowl on the slot in my earlier years at Louisville. And, you know, they just said that they were really impressed that I can, you know, play it inside, outside at my size. So, you know, I'm just, I'm just so excited to be a Titan right now. And with, Go ahead, Tron. If I could follow up, and, and with that, that your profile, right, 6'2", 208, maybe not a blazer, but you still have the ability to, to get vertical. What is it about you that allows you to do that? Why are you such a legitimate vertical threat? Uh, yeah, definitely, you know, uh, you know, it just works from, you know, me being able to run the underneath routes, you know, uh, me being able to run every route in the route tree, you know, I, I just keep them guessing, you know. It, it, I'm, you know, I, I like to say that, you know, I'm a complete receiver and, you know, not one dimensional. So, you know, I just keep them on their toes. Thank you. Terry. Des, uh, while you were at Louisville, did you play mostly the X position, the Z, or did you operate some in the slot as well? Yes, uh, I, uh, growing, uh, Definitely going back to my first two years at Louisville, I played the Z position, which allowed me to play inside and outside. But uh, the last two years at Louisville, I played the X position. Teresa? Uh, Des, how familiar are you with the Titans and their offense and the fact that they, they need some help in the receiving core? Yes, uh, you know, I'm definitely familiar with them since, uh, you know, Corey Davis was drafted there at first. And, you know, I've definitely been keeping up, obviously, AFC and everything. But, you know, I'm just very excited. You know, I'm, I'm, I get to learn more about their offense. I can't wait till the playbook comes and, you know, I, and I can study and see exactly dive in, deep down into it. Hey, Des, are you able to turn your camera on? Yes, yes. I'm sorry. There's... Yes, there's so many people calling right now. I'm no, sorry. you're fine. I bet you're blowing up. Uh, just a couple more for you, uh, Luke. Okay. Hey, Des, uh, congratulations. Did you meet with the Titans at the Senior Bowl? Uh, yes, I did. And what were those conversations like all the way back then? Uh, yes, yeah, the, the conversations were positive, obviously. Uh, you know, just talking about they like my stature. They like to, you know, how I can move at uh, a big size, a, a thicker frame. And, you know, they always ask me, like, you know, how would you like it, you know, back then, you know. So I'm just excited right now to be a Titan. And, you know, I'm just so blessed. And I'm going to lost that word. I'm just in shock. But, you know, I just can't wait to go down there, compete, and work hard. Glennon? Yeah, Des, uh, I know you touched on your uh, vertical uh, portion of your game earlier, but yeah, the uh, the big numbers and, and average per catch, uh, you know, 19 last year, 18 the year before, and, and I think 17 for career. Um, where does that come from, the ability to, you know, uh, kind of stretch the field and, uh, and and make big plays, and and how important is that uh, in your game? Yes, yeah, sir, it's definitely important. Uh, you know, I feel like uh, for you to be a deep threat, that's how it comes, you know, a, that's how you get your separation in your intermediate routes and your shorter routes. And uh, they respect everything if they think that you're going deep. So, you know, the, the slants and the hitches and everything, you know, works better when they respect your deep threat. And that's kind of how you got to go about things. Thanks. David Beauclair. Des, back in 2019, you actually played a couple of games at Nissan Stadium. Do you have, uh, you have any particular memories, any, any good vibes in relation to the place? Yes, actually, I do got. I do have some good vibes there. Definitely, <laughs> good memories. 
did you play well in those games or any 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 notable catches there? Yes, sir. Uh, you know, I played well against uh, Western Kentucky. And uh, the bowl game, I was sick, unfortunately. But, you know, I had a couple catches. Duran. Yeah, sorry about that. As far as the, the opportunity that you're getting here, you know, you're going to be opposite a guy that's pretty good in A.J. Brown. How excited are you to be able to tag it up with, with him as well? Yes, definitely. You know, I, I love to learn new stuff, you know, by the guys who've been doing it in the league, doing it well in the league. And, you know, I am definitely can't wait to link it up with him and talk ball and ask him what works out and, you know, how is he successful in the NFL and, you know, just learn. That's what I'm more excited about doing ever is, is just learning right now. So, Any particular players you, you watched a lot growing up or, or feel that you pulled aspects of the game from? Yes, uh, definitely. You know, growing up, obviously, I loved the Larry Fitzgeralds. I loved the Des Bryants. But, uh, you know, recently I've been really involved with uh, Devontae Adams. I love his game a lot. I, you know, I, I kind of think that resembles to my game. And, uh, you know, I'm just I'm just super excited to, you know, do everything. Paul? Hey, uh, wondering where you thought you'd get drafted. Is this about where you thought you'd come off the board? And and what other teams uh, wouldn't have surprised you today if they were the ones to call? Uh, yeah, uh, you know, I kind of, I know I really don't have any expectations going into it. You know, I know, you know, the board and, you know, the draft is crazy. You know, I was just expecting somewhere, you know, late day two to early day three, like around this, yeah, just around this time. But you know, a couple other uh, teams that, you know, I thought might have picked me up was probably, you know, the Rams or, you know, a couple other teams that were, you know, in contact with me a lot. But, uh, you know, I'm just so excited to be a Titan and I'm, you know, meeting new teammates and, you know, get involved with the offense and, you know, just learn my playbook and, you know, start the NFL life because this is what I've been dreaming for, my, you know, my whole entire life. And we'll close out with Jim. And Des, you touched on AJ. How much more familiarity would you have with guys on the team? And what do you think about your new quarterback, um, Tanny Hill? Uh, uh, wait, I'm sorry, say that again. You, you mentioned AJ. How, how much more do you know about the Titans? And what do you think about your new quarterback in Tanny Hill? Yes, sir, definitely. You know, I was actually, uh, when I got drafted, and everything kind of calmed down a little. Around here, you know, right in the hill, he hit me up, graduated me, and said he can't wait to work. And I just told him, you know, I can't wait to work work with him, and you know, just get down and become, you know, definitely a titan and grow and earn my stripes and you know, do everything that I have to do. And you cut out there for a second, but did you? I, I kind of got the gist of it. Did you say Taney Hill maybe text you and welcomed you aboard? And, and what? And yes, what did sir. you say? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, but yes, he said that. And, you know, he just said that, you know, he's excited for me to come down and, you know, he, he, you know, he felt like that was a good pick for him. And, you know, he likes my game and I got to be a weapon, you know, with his offense. And, you know, I just said, you know, I can't wait to come down and, you know, work out and compete with you guys and just learn how to be a Titan. And, and how good does that make you feel? I mean, the quarterback, starting quarterback already kind of reaching out to you. You know, that made me, you know, I, I, I felt like, you know, it's, it's, it's not, I'm a loss at words. I just, you know, I, I always said, you know, this is just reality now, but, you know, I feel like I'm dreaming right now, honestly. So I'm just so happy and so smiley and everything. So, you know, if I feel, I feel great that he texted me.